right at the back my phone hold off fell down black on its face so yay me right, let me blend this in i didn't wet my, wet my sponge it should have been i usually do but i'm not organized is everybody out <laughs> oh it's gonna take so long to edit Oh, hello, look at that by the way. Receiving hello, much? I'm 27. I have a receiving hello. Yay. I've lost my face. I used to do my eyebrow, my eyebrows first before anything else. I oh, like after primer, obviously. But now, since I've been using the Revolution pencil, eyebrow pencil, Revolution Pro, then I'm all coming, doesn't say. Had it for ages. I'm doing my eyebrows after I've done the rest of my face, which is so weird, but looks good. So, good coverage. Those foundations have got fantastic coverage. Incredible coverage. Nice. Right. Concealer on my head and under my eyes. Oh, I have a cut my finger. Nice. I work in a supermarket, by the way. So if you see cuts on my hands or my arms, because cardboard hates me. It's crazy. Look at that holy person. <laughs> I'm gonna carve out the forehead in a minute. Forehead, nine head, what you wanna call it. I'm going to use the Huda Beauty Tantor, which by the way is the best cream contour I have ever come across. Ever come across. It's insane and I've used it a bit, I don't know if you can tell. It's so good. Right, my little Different brush than I like them. I love this stuff, it's incredible. You just wait and see what else my big old forehead. Trust me, it's insane, it really is. Oh. Because, you know, that would be too, too easy if it just stayed out my way. Oh, I need to wash it as well. I'm not one of these people who, by the way, can uh, do both sides, like one side of one hand and another side of the other hand, no, right handed all the way. I'm not that talent talented. Look how nice that looks. Oh, guys. Oh my goodness. Right. A little bit more. On this side. Blow less. Um, do you mean? Do you mean? What am I going to do now? Oh yeah, I thought that was deep in there. I've got deep set under eyes, so. Just. Bear with me. I've got a brush. Obviously. This is not going to be. We're too easy. I'm gonna have a fan on there because it's hot. It's so fucking hot here. It's like 26 degrees, and I know, like in some places of the world, it's that's like nothing. But here in the UK, that's like okay. It's barbecue. Get your top off over for men. That's it. But, yeah. Also, I realised that I didn't do an introduction video on YouTube, so I apologise for that. My name is Annie, I am 27 years old, I live in England with my husband, and I am absolutely obsessed 
with makeup. And when I say obsessed, I mean obsessed with makeup. Um, we should be moving soon, and hopefully when we move, I'll be getting my own girls' beauty room. And I can't wait to go to Ikea. Can I get some fake parts in my room? I've already, like, added about eight of them to an online basket, just so I know what I want. But, you know, I've got to do with these things. When I turn to side, I don't see no deep grave crevice in the corner of my eye now. Right. <laughs> I'm going to use some setting powder. Which one do I use? I'm going to use the S one. I love this stuff. It's so good. It's so nice. I'm just going to get that out of my lip. Sorry. You got my lip by the way, isn't it? I won't fill up. But I don't know who to go to. So, yay. Yeah. I'm probably going to use this little brush I got from New Look. Little rose gold collection, like 15 pounds of them. Stupid, I did. I'm just gonna set my under eyes because I crease so much and I have oily skin. So, well, I'm oily to them. So I crease and then crease some more and then crease some more. I'm going to try and see if you can see it. Oh my god, I'm going to try and see if you can see it. Oh my god, I'm going to try and see if you can see it. We'll let that bake there for a couple of minutes. I'm just going to get a bit of a brush and sort out that. There we go. A bit better. Right. That's my base nearly done. I'm going to put on some blusher. I got a new blusher actually from Jolie Beauty. It is stunning. Look at the packaging. And the colour is even nicer. This is the plastic. Look at that colour. Oh my goodness. Look at that colour. Oh, and I haven't taken the plastic off the mirror yet. I must look weird. That is pigmented. Oh yeah. I did the fatal mistake no one should ever make. If I dab in my brush on there instead of that there and put it down. Why did I do that? Somebody. Please help me. Why does my brain think these things? Oh, that's better. Not on like that one, however. Well, that is gorgeous. So gorgeous. And I'm going to put some bronzer on. I'm going to use my Morphe E42 brush. Love this brush. And for my powder bronzer, um, what am I going to use? I'm actually going to use my Morphe Mastermind Glam Bronze Face and Body Bronzer, which is so nice. And it's light because I like light and I don't tan, I just burn, so you know. Bronzing up a bit to make it look normal ish. That's all that is nice. I like this. Oh, that one. I love this brush too. It's so lovely. It's so nice. Right, I'm not going to control today because I don't want to. Um, I'm going to get rid of this fake I did under my bronzer. Okay, and um, that's highlighter. Now, highlighter is one of my favourite beauty products. And I have so many. That, sorry, I was supposed to see. Don't want to see on camera. This is my favourite one. Excuse me. It's the MAC Snow Flush Extra, Extra Dimension Skin Finish. I think this was limited edition for Christmas. I dropped this and it fell out of the packaging. However, I managed to save it and it's fine, but look. It's the Duo Chrome. It's pink and gold. <laughs> right. Can you, can't even see that pocket, look at that. No. Can you even? Can you even? I might use that today, actually. I'm going to get a hand out of mush. Did you find one? Boom. Subsidy, Amazon, done. Oh yeah, I'm a makeup brush collector as well. Love makeup brushes. Can't help it. Probably could help it. Can't do anything. Got it in, I don't think. Mm. Let's try this one. Mm. Yeah, there we go. Can you see that? Also, my Ofra Nikki, Nikki Tutorials blonde highlighter. In glazed donut. <laughs> She's so, so genius. Ofra's just genius anyway with their highlighters. Lord have mercy. 
anybody tell me how the hell they do that shit? Like, I'm real. And I only need a tiny bit of this. Look at that. <laughs> I bet you dipped my brush in there. And oh my god. This, this is what happened when I was like, it's gone everywhere. And I'm not looking really shiny. So I just turned the brush over and then I'm going to try them. So, there we go. Done it all. Highlighter. Done it all a bit. Yes. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to do. Oh, sorry. I'm going to do my hair because I need to do my brows. I'm blind. Don't wear glasses, man. But I'm blind. So, you know. Um, I'm using the Audi La Cura little brow gel thing. Which. It's alright. I prefer the Benefit brow gel. Gimme brow. And then the 24 hour gel sitting thing for myself, can't know what they're right. um, but yeah, I feel like I'm going to my plates in. Look, can you see that? Ugh, it's going to get me in mind now. I have to, there we go. It's a bit warm, but I don't want to waste, so I'm going to use it anyway. Yeah. Um, I'd like to get those, make some friends on YouTube. So, you know, if you're watching this and you want to make friends or just have a chat about makeup, because I can talk about makeup all day long, um, comment, I suppose. I know I've got like four followers, which is great, <laughs> but, you know, a girl can always hide the dream, right? And I'm doing this the right way, so you can't actually fucking see anything like I've ever done. There we go. What do you think? Do you eyebrow? Know yeah. Right, on to eyebrow, number one, number two. Are you do use a brow pomade, however, when I started using this pencil, I was like, holy shit, it's a really good pencil, and you can get really good strokes if you don't bend it up like I did. Also, I think I'm the only girl on the planet that has not used Benefit Browsinger or the pencils. Like, I need some help. I'm the only girl, the only female on this planet who hasn't used them, I'm pretty sure. Like every one of my favourite YouTubers uses the pencils, and I'm just like, mm, I'm fine. Which I'm gonna start using them. Really good. Matching sisters. That would do. Right now, I've got my pencils on my highlight. I'm gonna use the P. Louise eye base. By the way, Sophie's fucking eye base in the whole entire world. If you don't use this, what are you do doing? I'm trying to find a brush to put it on my eyelid with. Snack like me every day. It's because I have a separate makeup everyday makeup case, I put all the brushes I use on the daily in there. So I'm like, you know, it's cool. But I brought most of it out so I could to do this video with. Also, fun fact, my phone is currently balancing on a sat nav holder for a car because you know I'm not that into YouTube yet, so I haven't got a camera or I haven't got like a stand or whatever. I've got a ring light, which is Yay, 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 and all of that, but, yeah, starting life right, you know, maybe one day I'll do a tour of my beauty desk when I get my beauty room um, all up and running, if we do get this house, which I'm hoping now, I'm currently just in mine and my husband's bedroom, um, filming my lovely desk, so, yeah, hope you don't mind. Um, if you do come across this video, thank you. And if you have got this far in, thank you. <laughs> Bear with me, I'm getting there. A little bit too much on this one. On this one. Or a little bit too less on the other one. Right. right. I'll do that. That will do. So today, I'm going to use the Beauty Bay Bright 42 colour palette. Yeah, 42 colour palette. I don't know if I can't take it on in the name of the palette, did I? Um, and I don't know what, because there's so many colours in this, look, look at that, look at my ring light, no, look at all the colours in that bad boy, like, the quality of these shades, if you haven't tried this palette yet, please try it, it's £23, hello, and it's good, quality pigment, okay, I don't know what to, I think I might do a sunset -y, like, orangey, because that's my go-to, really, most of the time, I did a pink eye the other day, like, a pink, um, and it was quite nice. So I'm going to go in with just peachy in the crease, I'm just going to blend that in. I'm going to put it on and then blend it in. 
And let me know if you need to be, if I should be zoomed in a bit more as well, which I think I should, because I'm using this right <laughs> Look at that, like, like, can you even, like, if I just bring you closer. There's no loss of pigment, there's no nothing, and it just goes for absolute days, which, thank you. Now I'm going to take a deep orange, and I'm just going to pop that in the very crease of my eye, like, in the very crease there, which, this one is called Heat Wave, fitting for today. I'm going to go back in with that brush that I used with the shade Just Peachy and just sort of blend that out just a teeny weeny bit. It's a bunch of it on the harsh line. Um, I'm set that down there for a second. Yeah, useful drawers, I'm telling you. Uh, I'm going to cut my piece very quickly. But you can't really. Um, I'm just going to turn my eyeball blue. And that's not something that I'm willing to do. Not today, anyway. Um, no. No. Why do I keep picking up weird things? <laughs> what? Oh, um, uh, there we go. That'll do. Couldn't I just pick that one up in the first place because that would be too easy. Yeah, you will see me looking over into that, into the mirror, because, like I said, I'm not professional. You know. Yeah. These are never the same, like, I can never get the same shape that I do my pocket pieces, but it's so frustrating. Because, yes, I have no CD with that, too. <laughs> Go away. Okay, I think that'll be. See what I mean? See what? How good is that? And then look at that monstrous mess. I don't know if it's stuck there. Right, on that lid, I'm going to put. Actually, this palette, the Prismatic palette from W7, um, I got this from Home Bargains. I don't know if you guys have ever been to Home Bargains before. It was 79p, and let me tell you, yes, 79p, it's so pigmented, it's unbelievable. It is incredible. I'm going to use this shade here. It's like a yellowy gold one. I think it's a dupe for the Cat 1D highlighter palette. Um, I don't know. I'm going to use this little brush that's from an Aldi palette. Mm. Right. Like, can you just... I'm not going to fall out. Like, can you just... Just look at that. 79p. I have witnesses. I will get them on here and show you, tell you that I have witnesses for buying this. 79p. Bargain of the century. And I feel like I need another one because I'm definitely going to use these. And they're good for highlighters. The pink one's a good highlighter. Just use a very light hand. Unless you're gonna go all out then, go all out. But they're very, very strong. And like I did on Thursday, I put on my face and it ended up having a big streak of colour up my face because you know. <laughs> Look at that. That's just how we roll in the Shire. I love the big bang completely. Right, I think we've got tiny little ones on over here. That would do, I think. As she says, she puts more on her eyelid. Right, definitely done. And then, what are we going to do? That's that done. We're going to do the lower lash line. And I have, have or had the perfect brush for it. Um, which is this one. No, it's not that one. Good grief. And again, it's Kevin. What are you doing? Pop 
Probably got pink on it from skin off with some tissue. Um, what am I going to put on the bottom lash line? Have a look at it now. Oh, it's half an hour long already. This video is immense. So I put some yellow on the Hello Sunshine. Oh, let me see the shade here. And I've got to make a TikTok video. But I think I've done half of one of those already. So I'm going to do a part one and part two. I will leave my TikTok in the description box if you want to go and watch TikTok. I just do swatches of makeup. I show you my makeup. I organise my makeup. Makeup is life. Also have Instagram. I'll leave that down in the description box too. If you would like. You don't follow. There we go. I don't know how I'm going to get rid of that fallout from the highlighter. It's going to be interesting. Now, I'm going to go in with the, this is the AOA Studio Skinny Mascara off of um, Shop Miss A. By the way, if you have not been on to Shop Miss A, which you should have by now, I was watching, I think it was Jordan Let's Go on YouTube, and I saw her go on there and her get a full face of makeup, and I was like, okay, my turn. <laughs> and I did, and it was insane. Like, absolutely insane. And so cheap. What? The only thing was the shipping, which wasn't actually that bad, and they pack your packages incredibly secure. Like, everything had bubble wrap on it and, and cardboard, and you know the, the cardboard that you get that's been shredded up to fill out packages? All of that was fantastic. Nothing was broken. Honestly, 10 out of 10. And then, I have to really concentrate on doing scarlet because not normal. Not normal. Body face shape and mascara application. Winning. Um, don't know if I'm going to do eyeliner. I might do. I've got this um, the Body Shop Wing Woman. There we go. And it's really good. I just went out with my Stila eyeliner, which, by the way, so good. I'm only doing this across my eyelid because I want to put lashes on. No, I have these lashes. These are from. Where have they got them? Let me I forgot. I think they're from Doll Beauty actually. And they are so good. I like the glue one. Yeah, they are. I've got another set here which are huge. Look at those. I've got to cut them down to size because I've got massive values. But yeah, these are from Doll Beauty. And incredible. Again. Thank you, Doll Beauty. Um, also, have you seen how much makeup's coming out for Christmas this year? I can't keep up with them and live to my bank balance, to be quite honest. <laughs> no money fails. Yay! But, okay. I'm going to use the duo glue. It's the one with the. like the brush, but it's just a bit plastic, really. It will stick on. And I think it's drying up because it's getting a bit icky. I'm not going to lie. There we go. Big fluff. I've got tweezers here. Big fluffy. Fluffy, fluffy eyelash. I really need to wash my hair, I'm sorry, sorry. Okay. I wait for them to dry for like, I don't know, 10 seconds or so, because with the shape of my eyes, and, I, and also I have hooded eyelids as well, so if I look you straight on, everything gets lost. Um, it just helps me with my application of eyelashes. Let's try. No. Feels so big. Look at those. I love it. Look. I'm going to scream on my eyeshadow. I'm not doing very well with these lashes today, I'm not going to lie. I'm not really going to put them on. It's not going well. Didn't leave them long enough, I think. Anyway. It's on. It's on. It's literally covered in my eyeshadow. Yeah. Literally covered in my eyeshadow. Tiny, tiny, tiny. 
get in there. Go again. Look, you can tell. Look. Actually, this is going to be a hell of a video. I'm going to hurry back up, honey. By the way, I swear. Um, I know it's bad. But I can't. Right, let's try. Yep. Instantly, my hair is like. <laughs> Like, you're kidding me. Where's the little pictures? This is what happens when an amateur has to film a YouTube video. Oh, it's not out in a minute. Mm. I think that one went on a bit better. Ish. I'm going to cut this one down a bit more as well. Right, and let that dry. I'm going to let that shit dry. Take that off because I'm annoyed because I did the full face and then got fucking annoyed with me on my head. Happy days. God. Um. Oh, I just found it lying actually on the bottom of I might put another shade. Of, on my bottom lash line because I feel like it's not that like like oh, um I can't get it with the box. My Judy's place. Love this oh, the quality eyeshadows. Go for this one too. Um just gonna grab this brush. Oh yeah. So much better. I think so much better. I'm gonna take a little bit of this orange too. I'm just gonna stick that on the outer corner of the bottom lash line. I'm gonna make an office. That's good. I'm gonna all the way down my face too. Mm-hmm. Now, that eyelash, eyelash is really um, not good. It's really piddling me off. Let's get rid of that. Is it just going to come off? Oh, it might. I might just have to cover that up a little bit if I'm a finger weasel. I can't see you. There we go. Oh yeah, that's, that's really sticking. That's not coming off. And I can feel you there saying that it's sticking. Oh yeah, it's Oh, I'm actually wondering if you're a bit stuck. Hmm. And that's actually, that lifts my face slightly. Happy accident. Look at my nose. Actually. Oh yeah, I like that. Right. In it. No, not finished. My favourite lip liner is the Huda Beauty contour in flirt. Lip contour in flirt. So much so that I've already used it. It looks big on the camera, but I'll tell you, there's nothing left in it. Um, because I can fall people into thinking I have a little bit of my lips. Um, I'm trying to find my lip sharpener, my lip pencil sharpener. Um, Anyway, oh, just... look at that. I'm just um, I love it. Also, the Huda Beauty lip glosses. Like I know, it's quite expensive, and don't get me wrong, I got mine through Glossy Box. Uh, but 
if you're looking for quality, go and get her lip glosses. They are unbelievable. I'm gonna get a lippy. Tomorrow, I don't actually use her liquid lipstick actually in um, girl pain, which smells so sweet. Look, I don't know, the candies, look at the chocolate candies. Look at the chocolate candies. There we go, and I still fucked up the lip. What do you guys think apart from my uh, dodgy eyelashes? Winning! Do you like makeup look? Any tips or advice how to not be a pillock while watching them in a YouTube video? Thank you!